Scientists may be a step closer to finding life in space. They've found a planet in the so-called Goldilocks zone, which means it has the right temperature to support life and has water vapour in its atmosphere. Ignition sequence start. We have booster ignition and liftoff. Why do humans explore space? It's one small step for man. Do we want to learn about our past, our future, or if we are indeed alone in the universe? We may be a step closer to knowing, as scientists have confirmed they've found water vapour around a potentially habitable planet. K218b has both an atmosphere and the right temperature to support life. We are delighted to present you with the first discovery of water vapour. The team behind it say while exciting, finding life is by no means guaranteed. And this particular planet is taking all the boxes. It doesn't mean that it's good or habitable for us human beings, because, for instance, we have found also that there's still a lot of hydrogen in the atmosphere, and hydrogen is not necessarily something that we will be comfortable with as human beings. K218b was first spotted in 2015. It's an exoplanet, meaning it's outside our solar system. It's around 111 light years away from Earth. To put that in context, one light year is just shy of six trillion miles away. It's what's called a super Earth, meaning it's around eight times the mass of our planet and around double the size. It's so far away, researchers haven't actually been able to see it directly. Instead, they've examined how starlight is filtered through the planet's atmosphere as it orbits around its own star. But what's it actually like? Well, we're not entirely sure. The water content could be anything from around 0.01% to 50%, which means it could have anything from a very rocky surface to one primarily covered by a thick sheet of ice. The discovery was made analysing data collected by the Hubble Space Telescope. It's being replaced in 2021, unlocking new possibilities for scientists. With a much bigger picture, more complete picture of what's the constituent atmospheres of these planets, then we'll have a much better idea of what's going on, whether you're interested in life or whether you're interested in planet formation. Scientists believe there are many more planets like K218b. In the search for life beyond Earth, this is just the beginning.